With little more than pride on the line at the Select Security Stadium, Liverpool and Arsenal put on quite a show on the final day, sharing eight goals in a thrilling encounter. It took 18 minutes for the first to arrive. Satara Murray's cross come shot, deceiving Sarri van Wienendaal in the Arsenal goal to give Liverpool the advantage. The lead didn't last long though, Arsenal restoring parity six minutes later through Dan Carter, the Gunners' leading scorer this season, unleashing a fearsome strike from 30 yards. And Carter was on target again soon after to give Arsenal a 2-1 lead at half-time, a shot bouncing awkwardly in front of Reds keeper Siobhan Chamberlain. Arsenal extended their lead after the break as Jordan Nobbs' long-range effort bounced off the post and into Chamberlain's net, making it 3-1. Liverpool weren't going down without a fight though, and three minutes later, Shanice van der Sanden cut the gap to one, collecting Caroline Weir's pass before beating Van Wienendaal. With 15 minutes remaining, Arsenal all but put the game to bed once and for all. Chloe Kelly restoring their two-goal advantage, turning in Asisat Oshwala's cross. And Oshwala then got in on the act, scoring against her former club in the fourth minute of stoppage time to ensure that the Gunners finished their campaign on a high, scoring five goals in a match for the third time this season. There was still time for one more goal, Weir's effort proving scant consolation for a Liverpool team who dropped to fifth as a result of this defeat. Arsenal finished third, five points adrift of the Champions League places.